led a violent weekend across Indianapolis, a triple shooting on the west side. An officer involved shooting on the east side. Between both incidents, at least six people were injured. WRTV's Rachel Wilkerson takes a closer look now at five. That officer is now on administrative leave. He was working off duty at Bubba's Bar and Grill when the shooting took place. The establishment wouldn't speak to us on camera, but says its thoughts and prayers are with all involved. I watched as the police came up and whatnot. One dude was like running in, in the parking lot and uh, he was saying I got shot and stuff like that. And I was just, you know, this is surprising. Ayani Colgrove says he heard the shots fired at this east side bar and grill on Saturday. I just heard a couple of shots go off and I was still kind of looking and then, you know, they started shooting just like a little bit more and I just, you know, took off. Indianapolis Metropolitan Police say an off duty officer in full uniform was working security. He tried to break up an altercation when a suspect fired shots inside the bar, injuring a man and woman. The officer then shot the suspect. All three were taken to a nearby hospital and survived. IMPD says the off-duty officer was wearing a body camera and will be investigated like any other officer involved shooting. He handled it pretty fast and whatnot. He just straight ran up there and whatnot, even though people were shooting and stuff like that. And so, you know, he, he did a good job in my opinion. Like, you know, he, he was just sitting in his car and he ran up and just got it all handled. Bubba's Bar and Grill says the staff of Bubba's is physically safe, but violence claims many types of victims. It goes on to thank on-site security for, quote, minimizing what could have been a much more serious incident. The long-standing neighborhood bar says it makes every effort to make Bubba's a safe environment for all. It's an awful shame that it comes down to that. Uh, this is a good place. The owner's a you know, good guy, and uh, it's an awful shame that, come, that come to a establishment like this to come down to an argument that leads to a shooting. Robert Gwynn stopped by today for a burger, only to find the doors were locked. We are in public and you're, uh, you know, you wouldn't have a good time and not lead to, you know, violence. It involves people getting hurt and, you know, it just, it's, it's, it has to stop. Rachel Wilkerson, WRTV. We have much more on this developing story. That man who was shot by the officer is now under arrest for battery with a deadly weapon and pointing a firearm. The IMPD critical response team and internal affairs will be investigating this incident. On the west side, a triple shooting claimed the life of a man and injured two others, according to IMPD. It happened just before 3 a.m. Sunday in this plaza off North High School Road near 38th Street. Police say one of the victims drove off but was shortly found a few miles away on Rockville Road. No names have been released in this investigation, but police are still looking for a suspect. 